Well, I mean, by the very nature of saying he's irrational, you're saying that he's not necessarily stupid. I mean, I know a lot of very, very smart people who are irrational um, in certain aspects of their life, or maybe in most of the aspects of their life. I would consider him immoral. Morality, fundamentally, in, according to Ayn Rand, is about using your reason. It's about using rational thought in order to pursue your values, in order to, to, uh, to pursue your life, to make your life the best, best life it can be. Her, her primary values are reason, purpose, self-esteem. So if you're not pursuing the primary value, then you're obviously you know, not moral. Uh, so rationality is an issue of morality, it's not an issue of ability. You can be, have a very low IQ and be rational. You can have a, be a very high IQ and be completely, utterly irrational. There's plenty of examples of that, unfortunately, in our society. So I think that whether you apply your mind or not, you know, in other words, whether you think rationally or not, this is the, for Ayn Rand, the fundamental ethical question. It's whether you engage your mind with reality to solve problems. And, the only, and that's what rationality is. It's engaging your mind with reality so problems, identify, figure stuff out. That's the essence of morality. And I know that's a very different way of looking at morality than what is common. But that's for who? That's because she's an individual. She's about morality is about making the most out of your life. And where do we get the values that are necessary for us to pursue our life? From rational thought. If you don't engage in rational thought, you can't pursue the values that are requirement for your life. Therefore, you're not engaged in moral